we now have these remote services with you know that can be done at the in the privacy and confidentiality of a, of a member's home and you've talked about how that might help look, improve the speed of access and and things like that how do you think this can help uh, break down the stigma surrounding treatment for substance addictions and, and maybe talking to me a little bit about some of the pitfalls that that you might uh, it, that it might encounter as well I, I think that I think that that is really going to help break down that stigma, right? Because you don't have to go to your company and say, I need to take four to six weeks off because of I, I've got to go inpatient. Being able to have that, it, whether it's daily or however, whatever the outreach is, to be able to do it in the comfort of your own home where it's it's may not be as stressed or it could be more stressed, but it may not be as stressful, but you've got that, that direct connection um, when you need it, right? So if, if you're having an episode at you know, 9 a.m. and you need that, that outreach right away, bam, you can jump on a, a Zoom call you know, these days. You can jump on a digital and, and text your coach if you need to or your therapist if you need to. I, I think it's just a game changer with virtual care. I think that's really going to help. Um, you know, we have seen a um, 15-fold increase in some of our telehealth visits. We've seen 80% um, of employers are more likely to use a, a, an emotional or mental health benefit if they can access it through their smartphone. You know, that was just something that we didn't see before. I was that type too that wanted to be in person, my, the doctor touching, feeling me. Now I'm like, no, I don't need to come in. I, I, I you know, let's just talk over the phone. Um, I think 48% are now have tried having a um, moving to like more online sessions. They're more open to it because they, they had to do it. There was mm. no choice. So I think this has really um, rapidly made us think outside the box and made us do things that we probably weren't as comfortable doing. It probably could have taken another five years for us to get to this point, but the pandemic forced us to be yeah. able to look at care differently and how we receive care. 